The strongest and the most well-known bird in America is the eagle. The eagle is majestic, it's big, it's strong, powerful, and there's only one other bird that would challenge an eagle, and that's a crow. So you're the eagle, you're big and bad. You have this crow right here, you're, you're the eagle. You got people saying, you can't do this, you can't do that, you got all this stuff, you got, you're not good enough, you're not fast enough, you're not strong enough, you're not, you're not, you're not smart enough. You have all these people pecking at you. When that happens, when the eagle is being attacked by the crow, or when you have people that are attacking you in your life, or people that you have naysayers and people that say you can't do it, what do you have to do? You have to, you have to soar, you have to, you have to rise. So what the eagle does, it, it flies to a higher elevation and the crow can't maintain that elevation with the eagle. So when the, the eagle's going up, the crow's trying to stay up, but the eagle flies higher. You gotta rise above from your distractions, you gotta rise above from your naysayers, you gotta rise above from all those people that say you can't do it, you gotta be that eagle. The eagle stays focused in its tunnel vision on what it wants to do. It's, it's focused on its goal, and it's focused on what it wants to attain, and then it can rise above all those naysayers and all those people that say you can't do it. Mentally, you have to be that eagle. Mentally, you have to block out all those things and stay tunnel vision. There's gonna be people gonna tell you you can't do this. There's gonna be people saying that you're not good enough. There's gonna be people that's going to knock you down every opportunity that you get. But don't let that stop you. I know what it's like facing obstacles. I know what it's like having people say you can't do it. But I never let those people stop me because I was so focused. I always kept climbing when everybody said I couldn't. But I believed in myself. The coaches can believe in you. Your family can believe in you. Your friends can believe in you. But if you don't believe in yourself, that doesn't mean anything.